know that is a standing board um, with members who are appointed in general to two-year terms. It is the only working group um, for um, delegated um, organization set up by the board where each member has a full vote. Um, most working groups or committees or subcommittees of the board, um, while they welcome the participation of various representatives, in the end only trustees vote. Um, this work group, everyone votes equally. Um, and this has been a part of the unique history of the socially responsible investment work group. Our mission is to provide information to the board, and more specifically to its investment subcommittees, about proposals that affect how the university is encouraged to manage the investments in down. That's it. Um, so while we are interested both individually and perhaps uh, as a group in broader social issues, um, in fact, our remit is simply to look at issues that can be implemented uh, within the context of the management, investment management of the endowment. Typically, those fall into two categories, um, shareholder activism, um, specific uh, ways in which we are encouraged to vote proxy that the university has by virtue of its share ownership, uh, to encourage change in companies or within industries. And secondly, divestment. Uh, divestment is a proposal that calls for the university um, to remove and um, not take on investments in specific securities, um, usually uh, based on issues about the behavior of the companies or uh, areas that are affected by that company or industry. Um, without going into too much detail, I will um, say that we have taken up proposals of both types in the history of this group. Um, we have several issues where this group has acted and the board has subsequently accepted the recommendations of this group. Our role, again, is to make recommendations, but we do not make final decisions that falls within the legal authority of the board through its uh, investment subcommittees. Uh, but uh, the recommendations of this group have had a very high rate of success uh, in acceptance by the board. Uh, we have had uh, shareholder resolutions uh, on issues such as landmines, tobacco, uh, and most recently in terms of uh, climate change initiatives. Uh, we have had divestment proposals uh, accepted in, in the past. Those include tobacco, uh, originally South Africa, uh, is, uh, companies doing business in South Africa, and most recently uh, companies uh, supporting the regime in uh, Khartoum and Sudan. All of the programs and issues that I've just addressed are remaining in force today. Um, I want to uh, outline the process the work group goes through. We gather information, we receive proposals, we have presentations, we try to form generally um, knowledgeable about the specifics of the proposals that are being put forward. We're looking not only at the merits of the social or ethical issues that are being raised, but also at the practical um, questions of can these issues be addressed through uh, action at the investment level, and if so, is the best way to do that through divestment or shareholder activism. Um, uh, and so there is an obligation not only to understand the social and ethical issues, but to understand how those might be implemented and what the impact 